The Casino DLC was released today, and there are surprisingly wasn't that many cars that were released. So that leads us to the question, how many are there going to be drip fed to us? And I don't know the exact amount because uh, I did not count them yet, but there's a good amount. The only thing, as you will see here in a second, is that there's only like two supercars, if that. So this is a very strange update, to say the least. So obviously uh, what we're looking at here is in the game files, these are all the vehicles that were released with the uh, this new DLC, although most of these are not released actually into online. They're just in the game files because they are a part of the drip feed. Uh, the Asbo, this is a vehicle that uh, we, we have. This is a little crap car. Then we have the Everon, and that's the truck, which we already have in the game. But we get into two of the new cars. And I guess instead of supercars, you'll be getting formula race cars. Because that's what we have. A formula race car. So, uh, yeah, we're going to be getting a formula race car. We also have a second formula race car. Little bit different looking. Uh, but obviously it's only one seat. And uh, I would hope these are maybe one, some of the fastest cars in the game. Continuing, uh, the Furia is uh, one of the few supercars, and it does look great. I mean, I love these rims. Whoops, let's not go that far in. I love uh, the look of these these rims here. And, I mean, it's just an overall pretty solid-looking supercar. The back is okay. I'm not a huge fan of this giant taillight, but uh, that'll be really cool. I don't think we know the prices of these just yet. Once we do, I'll be sure to uh, let you guys know. The I Morgan. This one could be a supercar. It could also be a sports car. It kind of looks like an electric car to me. Although these headlights look a little weird. Uh, here's the back, though. Not bad. I mean, it's all right. Then we have the JB700. It's only taken them nine years to uh, get this into the game. Into online, I should say. But we finally are going to be getting it. Now, we don't know if this is going to be weaponized or not. It is the JB700 2, so it's actually a separate model from the one in single player. So this might not actually have the guns on it. Which would make no sense because there's weaponized vehicles all over in GT Online, so it would fit right in. But, hey, at least it's finally coming to the game. Then we have the uh, the Kanjo. And this looks like the crap car that we got today. That's just a little nicer looking. And uh, what you'll see, because there's a lot of these like little, I guess, crappier cars, they'll probably have real good customization. Now we have the Komoda. Well, that's actually the vehicle that was released today. So we've already taken a look at that. The craziest one of them all, a mini tank. Now, I don't think this will be something you can drive. This might just be something that, like, it's like a drone, like the RC car. Uh, don't know much more about it, but yes, the tank from the arcade game is now in GTA Online. Or, well, will be in GTA Online soon. Then we have the Outlaw, another sort of off-road vehicle. They, they did a lot of this. I mean, like, I love this. I love the fact that they have added a bunch of, like, off-road and, you know, some other type of vehicles, right? They definitely, there's way more variety in this DLC. But uh, I just, I don't know. I dig supercars, and they, there's definitely a lack of supercars in this DLC. But this one does look cool. It probably has, will have some really great customization. Loving the back of it here. Continuing along, uh, the Rebla, I believe this is which, yeah, this is the SUV that came out today. Then we have the Retinue 2. So the Retinue obviously is already in the game. This is the second version of it. It would be freaking awesome if these cars were Benny's cars, but unfortunately, they're probably not going to be Benny's cars. So that, that's just, that's why I'm not like as excited for these. If these were all Benny's cars, whoo, man, my excitement levels and hype levels would be through the roof, but I don't know. They kind of went away from Benny's. Then we have the Strider, which is a... Th it's the opposite of uh, that one bike we have. The one we have, it's like the Chimera. 
It's got the two wheels on the back, one wheel on the front. This one's got two wheels on the front, one on the back. Not entirely sure why that was needed, but hey, I mean, it's not a bad looking vehicle. Then we have the Segoy. This is a four door, I'm guessing sports car. Although maybe it's a supercar. I don't know. It kind of has that sports car vibe. Looks awesome. I love the rims. Hopefully the performance on this one is good. Uh, here's the back, which is a pretty good back. The Sultan 2. Now this is like, it's going to be the Sultan Classic. But this is like, this is why I wish this was Benny's. Like how, you, we have the Sultan RS. And then they're going to introduce a Sultan 2 that's not Benny's. Like, come on. Please make this be Benny's. I really hope maybe they surprise us with that. Then we have the Vagrant, which is actually the one uh, that's already in the game. We have next up the Vester VSTR. Another, uh, I'm guessing, sports car. A lot of four-door sports cars in this update, which is kind of weird. This one definitely looks a little bit more luxurious, kind of like a Cadillac. Eh, not a huge fan. And then we have two more, the Yosemite 2, which kind of just looks like the Yosemite, just maybe with some more customization. I don't know. I mean, it's a truck. It's a low rider truck. Nothing much more to say about it. And then the final one, the Zaba, which may be the weirdest one of them all. I don't, I don't even ask. I don't know. I'm sure missiles will be coming out of this. But what in God's green name is this? This is, it only has one tire in this picture, but imagine this one tire on all of these. That's just going to look so odd. But those are the drip feed vehicles. Uh, don't know the order. Once we know the order and the price, I will be sure to let you guys know. But man, oh man, some interesting stuff coming. Let me know in the comment section what one, which one you're most looking forward to but it's going to be an interesting couple of weeks to say the least thank you all for watching this is going to do it for the video please drop it a like more casino heist videos will be coming out later today so be on the lookout for that but as always i'll see you guys in the next one